Hey guys,、uh, this is Lei from Goldfish Corner. Today's topic is about how to ship your goldfish. Well, shipping goldfish or mailing goldfish is not a new topic, but it's actually a new topic for me. This is my first time to ship out goldfish. I have、uh, breeded a bunch of、uh, blue egg phoenix goldfish. And I showed this on YouTube, and a lot of friends actually interested. So I already made my first order with my local friends. But this time,、uh, one of the friends from Philadelphia, he also want to have one of my goldfish. I said, "Well, let's do a trial."、Uh, I did some online study. There's four big steps. So step one is pre-shipping.、Uh, step two is packaging. Step three is ship out. And step four is Follow up. So step we call a pre-shipping preparation.、Uh, I call a fact. Fast the fish for two days. And check the pickup truck schedule, and check the weather forecasting, and also talk to your customers. Okay. So the second step is what I'm going to do today is the packaging. So. Let's come to see my fish. So this, a beautiful blue egg phoenix. I fast for two days. Basically, no food.、Uh, I don't feed anything, so I keep them in the same tank. I just isolated with a little breeding、uh, net. So first,、um, in terms of the packaging, you need a bag. One thing I want to make sure is you need a, a high quality bag, at least three mils thickness. You don't want to put too much water. Maybe just one third. Volume of your shipping. I normally grab the fish with my bare hand. I don't. I don't use the、uh, fishing net, so I can feel the fish.、Uh, I can move a little bit better. Pretty active, even though it hasn't eaten anything for three days. So the next step, or the most hard part, is to oxygen, because you not only give the water but also get oxygen. I, Uh, many people question where do I find my oxygen tank? It's so expensive.、Um, the tip I got is I got this little package from Lowe's, Burzomatic,、uh, for welding kit. It has、uh, the red tank for oxygen and yellow tank for、uh, propane. And for this case, we just need、uh, the red tank for oxygen.、Um, so the kit actually come up with the with a little bit tubing.、Um, leave the propane、uh, tubing. Off, and you just need the red tubing connect to the oxygen. One thing I want to make sure, make sure you know the oxygen connection is left-handed thread. So if if it doesn't work, make sure you thread it reversely. So it's left-handed thread. All right. So now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna squeeze out. I'm gonna squeeze out the air. As much as I can. Twist it really tight. Then you put the rubber band. I'll just get get one more. Um, the second thing you want to do is you want to have the backup bag. So second bag. The reason, in case if there's some leakage, so you're not gonna damage your、uh, packaging box. So the second one. So next one is、uh, put in the box. Also gonna have some form. I put it already. Again, so I'm gonna put in my package over here,、um, sort of diagonally. Hey guys! Well, after some labor work, I guess I just finished this package. Now I'm gonna put my insulation package on. All right, and this gonna fly to Philadelphia. All right, guys, that's it. Here is the shipping box.、Um, I finished all the first two steps.、Um, now I think it's ready for shipping.、Uh, the last step. 
and uh, I'm gonna show you a video later to see whether the fish is actually alive or not. Alright guys, stay tuned. I'll see you soon. Bye guys. Hey guys, today is the big day. Uh, my friend Lei from the Goldfish Corner on YouTube has sent me this box. And in box, in the box, is one of his Blue Egg Phoenix fish that he bred himself. So this was two day shipping from his home in Houston, I believe it is, all the way out here to the East Coast in Pennsylvania. So uh, the delivery man just brought it and let's open it up and see if everything came out okay. in it all the way to the inside of the box all the way around these are airbags to stop the water from moving around and let's see we got in the bag oh I see movement I see movement and here we have one live blue egg Phoenix beautiful now the water does feel a little bit on the chilly side, so I'm gonna go ahead and go pop this in my tank and uh, get it acclimated to the temperature so I can set him in the quarantine tank. Looks like our, uh, our fish experiment was a success, Lay. Thank you so much. So just quick recap. Uh, step one, pre-shipping homework. You're gonna fast the fish for two or three days. Uh, you ask the pickup truck uh, pickup hours. Uh, you're also gonna check the weather forecast. Uh, you also need to talk your customer to give them expectation, let them know the shipping box is gonna come in. Uh, step two, in terms of the packaging, you need a one-third volume roughly of the water and two-third volume of the pure oxygen. In terms of the oxygen kit, I can get the welding kit from local store. If you don't able to get from local store, I'm gonna share a link underneath my description from Amazon. You can also, the price should be anywhere from 70 to $75. And also double bag packaging uh, using the rubber band uh, seal or elastic band seal as much as you can. And then you just uh, wrap around uh, the taping. The other thing I wanna make sure, when you tape the corner, make sure you also tape the corner so they're gonna prevent the damage. Uh, step three, you're gonna drive over to UPS store. So typically USPS, UPS and FedEx, all the major shipping company are able to ship your uh, animal or fish overnight. So